is, I cannot dismiss Class Zero's actions. We are in this predicament because of them. And as Class Zero's commanding officer, don't think you're off the hook either. Of course not. I accept full responsibility for their conduct. Although having left the front line some time ago, I take it one of the four champions of Rubrum can still fight. You will take part in the next mission, and once again bring glory. If you are able to lead our forces to victory, then I will pardon Class Zero for their recent transgressions. You are too kind, Commandant. I will do all in my power to live up to your expectations. What can a walking corpse like him do? You know, sometimes you can be quite cruel. We all know that the Ice Reaper is a broken vessel. The best Karasame can do is pass on his knowledge. Sending him onto the battlefield would merely add to the list of casualties. I'll have him provide support for the Lucy. Besides, I'm more concerned with what happens after the battle. It's about high time that we showed Dr. Aratia her proper place. So you would have Class Zero and Crossame die in battle just in order to oust Dr. Aratia? The end of Class Zero will be the end of that woman as well. We will surely suffer great casualties in the coming battle, and it is more than likely that we will lose. Then, it would only be prudent to rid ourselves of those who might get in the way. I will not allow that woman to control the Consortium after the war. All I ask is that you not involve the Chancellor and I in your schemes. <laughs>